Belgard introduces a revolutionary new way to show your customers what Belgard products will look like on their home or office before you actually install it. Belgard rendering software will allow the paver installer to take a picture of the customer's site with the digital camera and then show that customer how great Belgard interlocking pavers will look on their project before they make their purchase. And as you know, if you can show your customers what the project is going to look like, it removes their doubts and concerns. This allows you to close more sales faster. Now I'd like to take a couple minutes to show you just how quick and easy Belgard's rendering software is to use. First you would take a picture of the prospect's project with your digital camera and then open it in Belgard's rendering software. The next step would be to define the area where you want to place your interlocking pavers. In this case we're going to place them on the driveway. So we want to use our drawing tools. So what you do is you just click points around the driveway area as I'm doing here with your mouse. Once you have the area defined, it turns gray, then you click on Belgard Pavers, and it brings up the library of all the products available. To see the different products that are available, you can scroll through the products library, or you can sort by pattern, or you can sort by color finish. So let's sort the library by products. So we're going to go down here to Cambridge Untumbled, and we're going to pick a color by simply clicking on it, and you'll see that it applies it to the driveway. The next step would be to adjust the perspective so they look like they're going off in the distance. To do that, you simply grab the perspective handles and line up this line with the edge of the driveway on both sides. And basically you're done. In a matter of seconds, you have the pavers placed in the driveway. Once you have the perspective and scale set, it's really quick to try out different colors. Just go back to Show Library, click on a new color, and as you can see, it pops there in the driveway in a matter of seconds. Or you can even try out new products. So let's go down here to, say, a Holland Stone, and let's try a Holland Stone on here. So now that we have the driveway defined, let's go back in and add the walkway here. So let's click OK to exit this menu, go back into the Drawing Tools, and I'm going to go in and draw over this walkway here. And I'm going to extend it out a little bit, and I'm going to give it a little bit of a curve here. So as you can see, as I define that, it filled it in with the pavers. Now let's zoom in, and let's get the porch here. Now as you can see, I've also added a walkway going to the backyard here. So let's say we also want to put in some soldier course borders along the driveway here to accent a little bit. So what you would do is again go into the drawing tools and then draw in where you want the borders to be. Now let's say we want a row going down here to divide up these two driveways. So now I have my areas defined. I'll go back into the pavers. I'm going to go down here and get soldier course. And these are Holland stones, so we'll go get the Holland stone colors. And let's pick the real blend. And again, you adjust the perspective on it. Now, the real blend doesn't show up on real blend. So what I'm going to do is change the color. So let's get something that shows up a little bit better. Adjust the scale there. Let's try the Sedona. I like the way the Sedona looks. So now we have the border set in. Now let's say you wanted to try a cobble circle over here to see what it was going to look like. We'll go up here to the object menu, bring up our Bergerac circles, and we'll use the Sedona blend. Let's size it down. And we'll use the warp tool to warp it to make it look like it's laying down on the driveway. And after looking at it, I really don't like it, so I'm going to delete it. Now, in this scenario, we've made the house look a lot better and the driveway looks great, but really, I think the landscaping could use a little sprucing up. The program also comes with a plant library. If you go up here to plants, you'll see there are many plants to choose from in here. So you just pick a plant from the library. It comes up on the screen. You can size the plants down, place them where you want them. So by doing this, we're going to add a little landscaping to this. So now in a couple minutes, I've added some landscaping to this image to finish it off. So let's say we also want to label it with the product that we used here on the driveway. To do that, we'll click on the driveway, 
We'll back up to our patterns. Now, I could have done this earlier, and it specifies what the manufacturer is, the color of the product, the type of product, and the pattern. In this case, it's Holland Stone, and it's a basket. So I click Stamp It. A name comes up on the screen, and I can take this name, and I can move it anywhere on the screen. Let's put it down here in the street. Also, I want to load up the before picture to show them what it looked like before and what I'm proposing. So now I have the before picture up on the screen. I'm going to move it up to the corner of the screen up here. Size it down a little bit more. So now when I print this out, it's also going to have the before picture so they could look at their house and see what it used to look like and what I'm proposing with the name and the products here on the picture. And of course you could put your company's name and phone number on the picture because you know they're going to be showing this to their neighbors and showing them what their house is going to be looking like in a couple weeks. Of course this can be printed out in full color on photographic paper. The other great thing about Belgar's rendering software is that everything in the program is an independent object, meaning that it can be changed at any time. You're also able to save it in a JPEG format so that you can email it to the customer so that they couldn't change it, but it's a compressed file so they could get it through the email. And then if they should call you back and say, you know what, we decided we don't like the landscaping or we want to move some plants around, you can go back in and change the landscaping in a matter of seconds. You could even change the pavers. So let's say they decided they wanted to use a different uh, color Holland Stone on here. We could just scroll down to those pavers and then simply expand the library out and you can click and drag the different products onto the driveway and try them out in a matter of seconds. Resave it again and email it back to them. The program also allows you to visualize wall stones by using the same techniques. You're able to just click and drag different wall stone colors on the walls you've defined. And as you can see, they are also changed in seconds. The same is true of stone veneers. Your software comes with the products available in different regions across the United States. So contact your local Belgar dealer to get a copy today for your region. So start closing more sales and growing your business today with Belgar's rendering software.